Whew. All right, YouTube. Uh, I just got my DD214. I sign out on leave tomorrow. This is probably the last time I get to wear this uniform. It's been a fun ride. I'm actually going to miss some of it. So, it's been kind of a stressful, emotional last uh, several months. Just trying to line up my future and take care of things. It's been quite a ride. Just wanted to share that with you guys. But hey, I'm going to go sign out on leave right now. It's like 5.20 in the morning. I'm excited for, uh, I got what, 60 days of leave. Finaled out of the army yesterday. I got a lot of mixed feelings about it. Sign on leave and I'm going to go work out. Done. Actually, pretty excited. Leg day. Can't do squats because I broke my back. I can do the leg press. As I go before my back starts to hurt. So done. Whew. Did some legs, went for a two-mile run. Did like a couple sets of muscle-ups. Check. Alright, so I got a problem. And it has to do with sunglasses. You know, to hold them right, I feel like there's too much space right here. And I have an uh, above average nose, got a nice big schnoz on me, and like I want it to sit maybe like so, but I mean there's like quarter inch, half inch difference there, so when I try on glasses, man, it just, I don't know. If you got any good advice for glasses, maybe I should just grind it, and uh, maybe I'll take that nose piece out, and it'll fit a little better. See if I take that nose piece out. It almost fits right. Or better. Now these are military issue ballistic glasses, but it's a similar problem with all glasses. You know, maybe I can just grind it and take out the nose piece, but maybe that looks funny too. Anyway, if you got a solution for this, let me know. You know, I'm cheap. I don't like paying for stuff, and I got like three, four sets of these iPro sunglasses, ballistic wear, whatever you want to call them. Let me know what you think. So I made one of these peanut butter mouse traps. I was going to throw it away, <laughs> but I had a surprise in there. So we're going to take care of that guy. I have chickens, and I put it out there, and every once in a while I catch something. I was totally surprised to see that in there, so... I mean, sometimes they work. I haven't had much luck with the kangaroo mouse, field mice. They seem to uh, go after the peanut butter. They slip off. <laughs> so, a little surprise for the day. 